here on Santa Rosa checking on the Lobo Canyon Lime Point Peregrine Pair. We've got two eggs being incubated right now. Today's April 5th. Those eggs were laid within the last week. For those who have been to the island before, this is the entrance to Middle Ranch and junction of Middle Ranch and Cape Canyon, or Middle and Cape Canyon. That used to be Cape Canyon Road. It is currently Cape Canyon River. We're at about 24 inches of rain for the season, where our average is about 12. The Two Harbors cam is down, so I just checked our relay site up above Two Harbors. Everything is good there. So I'm most likely going to have to hike down to the nest area and reset the switch down there. So it'll take a while to get there. I've made it down the ridge to where the gnarly tree is. If you look over, the overlook camera is in the center there. In the center there is the tree by the cactus patch that they often roost in. And this is what you don't see from the overlook camera is what's on the back side of the gnarly tree ridge. Up at the top is the relay site I just came from. This is the uh, power supply for the two members cameras. Unfortunately, it looks like the power has blown. So I'm going to have to wait till Explorer can get me a new switch and power supply. This is Bird Rock, just off of the village of Two Harbors on Catalina. I've never seen as many birds on Bird Rock as there are now. It's mostly brown pelicans, both on the rock and in the water bathing. This is Scorpion Rock, just east of Scorpion Anchorage on Santa Cruz Island. There's Anacapa Island off in the distance. And today I'm looking for a pair of eagles that have been around this area for a couple years now. Henry from the 2017 Fraser Point Nest, and we don't know who the female is yet. A lot of restoration has been done on Scorpion Rock to provide habitat for nesting seabirds. I think I found what is probably the first nest for the new scorpion bald eagle pair. It's a bit east of Scorpion Anchorage, up in a, looks like an old Toyon, pretty out of the way. The male was perched maybe 100, 150 meters from here earlier in the day. There's a wider view of the area. That's the likely nest in the middle. I 
I located the eyrie in the center of the cliff. Should be about in the center of this image. The bird is incubating, so I haven't seen how many eggs yet. Here's a view of the eyrie with the bird incubating. This is the smuggler's bald eagle nest on March 30th. They had three eggs the last time we checked on February 17th. I confirm there's at least one chick, possibly two, uh, less than a week old. So these are the first chicks that we've actually ever seen in a nest for this pair.